Jonathan Lee Riches Investigates. I am out here investigating the Brian Koberger Moscow, Idaho case. Secret witnesses who are going to testify at the Brian Koberger trial. The defense supposedly has some witnesses out there. Maybe or maybe not. We don't know. But the prosecution has submitted to the court a proposal for a deadline for the defense to provide a list of who their witnesses are going to be. Yes, under Idaho Court Rule 16C3, the defense has to provide the prosecution a list of their witnesses that they want to share and who will testify at the Brian Koberger trial. Check it out. Idaho criminal rule 16 requires the defendant upon written request by the prosecuting attorney to furnish the state a list of names and addresses of witnesses the defendant intends to call at trial. Idaho criminal rule 16 C3. A written response to a discovery request must be served within 14 days of service of the request. There is a continuing duty to disclose the subsequent discovery of additional evidence or witnesses prior to or during trial is subject to automatic discovery under the original discovery request. The failure to comply with the discovery request is grounds for the imposition of sanctions by the court. So, Brian Kohlberger's defense at this point now has 14 days to respond to that request once the judge issues an order to set a deadline to provide list of witnesses, secret witnesses, or any type of witnesses. And it goes both ways, folks. The prosecution also has to do that for the defense under Rule 16B6. So who could these secret witnesses be? Because you can't, under Idaho court rules, it looks like you can't just come up at the last second and be a witness. The prosecution will know who these witnesses will be, who could be the witnesses in the Brian Koberger case, considering that he hasn't provided an alibi for his witness, for his witnesses, like as a witness, who will the witnesses be? Who could they possibly bring to this case that could say Brian Koberger didn't do this, or Brian Koberger's character didn't do this, or Brian Koberger was somewhere else, or Brian Koberger, uh, you know, whatever they can do or bring to help Brian Kohlberger. I'm not sure they have any that I can think of. Now, I know that the prosecution has to also provide the defense a bunch of witnesses under rule color, uh, Idaho Court Rule 16B6. They have a deadline too, so it's no surprise on the defense when the prosecution puts people in the stand, but it, you know, Bill, Dylan and Bethany, IGG people, investigated, uh, um, investigators that were investigating this case. I could probably 10 or 15 witnesses. But who is the prosecution or who is the defense's witnesses? And I can't think of any. I can't think of any. Can you? Do you know anyone that will come? Anyone from the Steptoe Apartments? Well, Brian Kohlberger's uh, parents, siblings, sisters, will any of them be witnesses in this case? A lot of unknowns when it comes to the Brian Kohlberger case, but we are on it and it's going to be very curious on who they, um, you know, submit, the names they submit to the prosecution. We will most likely not get the names because a lot of these, these uh, you know, supplemental requests for discovery and different things have been sealed on this case. So we'll probably won't know to trial. Um, if the defense doesn't provide the prosecution with a list of witnesses, they are subjected under uh, uh, rules, um, Idaho court rules to sanctions. And that will be interesting too. But the prosecution at that scheduling order was like court set a deadline. So there'll be a deadline and it will give the prosecution enough time to vet these witnesses and do their due diligence and homework. So when these witnesses of the defense testify trial, the prosecution will be able to cross-examine them and be prepared. And it goes vice versa with the defense too on prosecution witnesses. Subscribe to my channel, like who, 
hit the notification button. Let me know who you think will testify on behalf of Brian Christopher Kohlberger. I am covering this case out investigating. We will talk soon. Stay tuned.